Hello everyone, I'll be making a video over the components for to service a 1.9 diesel TDI AHU1 or 1Z engines from uh, Volkswagen. I'll be going over the part numbers you need for uh, everything in the engine, the timing belt, the serpentine belt, the auxiliary belt for the AC or uh, water pump and the tensioners you need the part numbers okay so the first one is uh, the timing belt you can just uh, get any brand or the one you like this is uh, an off brand that I decided to get I'll be writing down all the part numbers in the description so you don't have to be pausing the video but you can get that one. This is a 137 uh, tooth timing belt. It's a uh, warranty for about 60,000 miles, which is about uh, how often you should change your timing belt. And then the serpentine belt. This is for the a regular serpentine belt. And this one is also like a 50,000 or miles or less replacement. This one is pretty simple and this one is the hardest one and also uh, this is going to be the uh, auxiliary for the uh, steering wheel pump um, I will be replacing I just got a chi the cheapest one out of all three this one was like $30 this one was maybe like 10 another 10 here and then the tensioners this is the upper roller that's a poor number like I said I'll be uh, putting it down in the description so you don't miss it or you copy it it's brand new it's off brand too and this is the uh, uh, lower tensioner it's plastic but it's brand new it needs to be replaced in the service of the timing belt and those are the components you need to service an engine 1.9 AHU and 1Z engines, not the AHL. That one, uh, you need different components. And while I'm going to be servicing the vehicle, I'll be replacing the fuel filter, changing oil with the synthetic oil, and uh, replacing also the fuel filter. This is uh, an off run to you fuel filter you can get the original but I'm fine with it and I'll be since my car is already like 200,000 miles I'll be using a purge diesel purge liquid molly this is going to reduce any deposits on the pump and the cylinders I'll be doing another video to show uh, the type of tools you need to replace the timing belt how can you get them and what uh, what else you can use as a replacement please like the video that's gonna help me a lot thank you